My name is Joachim Larsson. I'm a professor in environmental pharmacology at the Department of Infectious Diseases at the Solgrenska Academy, the University of Gothenburg. I'm also the director of CARE, Center for Antibiotic Resistance Research at University of Gothenburg. And it's a center that deals with uh, different uh, challenges related to antibiotic resistance. All SDGs are of course important, but uh, as I'm working with health, this is obviously the, the goal that is closest to my uh, heart. Uh, we have uh, unequal health in the world. Some have uh, the fortune to live in countries with very good health systems, as we have here in Sweden, while many people in the world are not. Uh, I think everyone deserves good health. One of the challenges that I'm personally interested in is uh, the fight against infectious bacterial diseases. And uh, here we have been lucky for the past decades to be able to treat many of those with antibiotics. But antibiotics are losing their power gradually and we're not able to keep up pace with development of new antibiotics at the same time. So this is a severe challenge to uh, our health systems. Uh, it's not only the treatment of infections that is threatened, we actually threaten the uh, entire healthcare systems as we know it. There's so many other situations where we need uh, antibiotics. For example, any kind of advanced surgery where we need it for protecting against infections or uh, when people are undergoing treatment uh, that uh, compromises their immune system, for example. Uh, I'm interested in both understanding the mechanisms, how resistance develops, particularly the role of the external environment, but also aspects on, on how we can make a change and how we best motivate changes on different levels, both here in Sweden and uh, globally. If I was given that possibility, I would probably invite uh, Donald Trump. Not because I think I would enjoy his company very much or share his ideas, but because of the opportunity to influence, of course. Uh, so um, at such a FICA, I would uh, illustrate what, try to illustrate what happened, what would happen if we don't combat uh, the issue of antibiotic resistance better uh, and uh, I think that could be a good motivator for, for anyone if you, if, if you realize what is at stake if we don't treat this seriously. Do you think he will listen? I hope he will listen uh, for his own sake and for his fellow citizens uh, sake and for the world. As I would then probably represent the medical natural science field, I would bring along a philosopher that uh, could uh, point out the moral responsibilities uh, to act uh, appropriately uh, to these challenges. Yeah, sounds like an interesting figure. I think so too. Thank you very much.